Well, I, we are doing this apparently now. I'll close the window. Oh. It's already closed. It's already closed. Okay. We have fucked up. Yes. So what happened was we tried to do a stream of Nosferatu, The Wrath of Malachi, a very interesting vampire game made for very interesting vampire game players. Common is doing exaggerated air quotes right now, possibly because he's lost his inherited gift of human speech, which he stole from a magical woodland creature. So, if you're a magical woodland creature and you use your magic to steal other people's voices, don't go to the dentist. Yes, because Common is now even less articulate than normal. So what do you think, Common? Are we going to play on easy, medium, or nightmare mode? Well... You're, the one question is, do you want to win this game? The other question is, do you want to suck at this game? The third question is, do you want to actually be able to kill female vampires with their own snakes? Uh, so Common has been looking up the Nosferatu wiki. In addition to acquainting himself with the rich Nosferatu lore, he now has all manner of pro strats and trivia facts. Uh, that rave, I think, means that the game is constructing its procedurally generated castle. So... What do you think, Common? Should we play this roguelike style, or should we uh, save every so often because the game sometimes kills you for bullshit reasons? I'm thinking we'll probably do that one, because I don't feel like destroying this computer just yet. It's still useful to me. Sure, whatever. <sighs> so the premise of this game, as we're being told by this cutscene, which yes, is supposed to look like that, is that... Uh, your sister, whatever, ver marries a vampire man, and nobody knew this. On a misty October you know what? I'll night let the, the European man mountains. describe it himself. You arrive to join your family and some of their closest friends at Castle Malachi, <laughs> where your sister Rebecca is to be wed to the son <clears throat> of the wealthy Romanian European count. Drink. Is he actually European? Yeah, they're Arriving listening to the rich Nosferatu the narrative, Common. There's family. no subtitles You're in this game. You're thrilled about the reunion and the festivities that will follow. However, as the coach oh, taking you from the train sunshine. station hurries through yeah. the fog towards the dark and ominous looking castle, you get a horrible feeling that everything is not what it is supposed to be. Wait a minute, this castle's spoopy. And we have. All tabbed out. It does that sometimes for no reason. What the fuck is this game? Nope, that's music. F2? There we go. <laughs> Alright, so this is how the game starts. Yep. Well, this looks spoopy as fucking hell. Welcome to Castle Malika. Hi. I will be... This is probably a bad sign. Your butler, let me take you to the vampire that will be drinking... Oh, I mean to uh, your uh, brother-in-law. I don't know. If I had a choice between my brother-in-law and a vampire who would murder me, I think I'd go with the brother-in-law. Oh, okay. So, take a look at uh, our Englishman Fists of Fury here. Yeah. Oh, since we're talking about the Fists of Fury... Yeah. Adam, we've played this game before, and there are weapons including sword canes. Oh boy! <laughs> oh god, it's never not funny. <laughs> he's probably dead. Don't worry about him. Yeah, he's fine. <laughs> so there are many weapons, including machine guns and the such. <clears throat> Would you want to gather a guess at what what the best weapon in this game is? Rocket launcher. Your fist. Really? Yes. No. Yes. Because they stun lock. Yes. No. Yes. This game is that stupid. <sighs> well, okay. I guess I better figure out how to summon my fists at a moment's notice. What is it? Uh. They do not have a dedicated mouse button. I think. <laughs> Let me take a look. Of course they do. Yeah. No. Uh, I, I just need to find them with the the thing. Did the music just turn off? Ah, oh, James. Okay, oh no, not the father. So this is the first uh, bozo you're going Please to... Bring Dr. Would you shut the fuck up and let me explain the game? Okay, here we go. <laughs> this is the first bozo, and the idea is that there's a bunch of guys around the place, and if you rescue them, uh, sometimes they give you things. This game is basically one big escort quest. So I need to find a doctor to heal this guy. And I to do that, I need to... 
kill a bunch of vampires. Kill a lot of vampires. Fists? Really? Yes, fists. <sighs> so I, you can light a torch. I don't actually know why you would do that. All right, let's try fists. Uh, sorry, it's just alt tab. All right, come on. Uh, oh yeah, there he is. Hi. Hey, how's it going? Hi. <laughs> Let me introduce myself. I'm Jack. I'm the brother-in-law. So this is a nice place you got here. Uh, where's my guest room? Am I just gonna sleep on the grimy flagstones, or have you got some sort of sepulchre in which I can rot? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So good. Such <laughs> punch. Much dead. What the fuck? <laughs> that went shockingly well. Alright, so there's health packs in this game because, of course, there are. Do I have any stakes? I do not. Uh, it's okay. I you have the best weapon in the game. Yeah. You are already dead. <laughs> Luckily, she's got some combat rolls. <laughs> oh my god, this is amazing design. It's like, why do I even need the guns? Well, because there will be some points where you fight multiple enemies. I guess. Yeah, just hi, father. Here, let me push you away from the bridge, because we all remember last time what what happened. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Just sort of swiffer on over there. Oh, I'll miss scratches in the wallpaper. So how this game works uh, with the health packs is if you've already uh, you're already at full health, you can suck it. Yeah, eating a health pack actually just uh, gives you temporary health that ticks down way too fast. So, uh, I always save health packs for later. Oh, got some heckles and jackals. So, what do you think their intended um, name for this enemy type is? Um, peasant dipshit, Igor, zombie farmer, farmsman. I'll tell you when you get it. Okay. Ghoul? No. Uh, Revenant? No. Henchman? No. Manservant? No. Uh, Gigolo? No. Uh, Mr. Scythe? No. Tweedledee and Tweedledum? No. They're gypsies. Really? <laughs> This game is just full of really good design decisions, Adam. Like, not only is that racist, it's the wrong kind of racist. A Transylvanian lord would not just have a bunch of... travelers... in his castle. <laughs> that would Neither party would find that a desirable arrangement. Hi, Father. I still haven't found the doctor. So we have... Stop asking. We haven't found... In fact, found the weakness of the fists, which is, uh... You can only, uh... Occupy one bozo's attention at a time with them. Any other health packs? Yeah, there's one around here. Alright, uh, I think that's enough screwing around, Common. Let's strike the earth. No, don't Four waste bullets. your precious bullets. Uh, I figured I might run it. I think there's, like, a couple enemies... <laughs> I remember I've done this, uh, this. I've done the starting area a few times, and I remember that there's East Wing Key. I thought I got the East Wing Key. What the hell is it? What did I get? Oh, it's is it down here or across there? Uh, I have no idea. Whatever. We'll just we, we should probably do make a sweep for more health packs before we continue anyway. This game has a completely superfluous stamina system. Wherein uh, stamina is drained by sprinting and making attacks. Melee attacks. Melee attacks. Obviously, you know, it doesn't take a whole exertion of effort to let off a round. Father, where is the key? You're supposed to give me a key. He gave me he gave me a crucifix, I think. Actually, did he give me a key? I feel like he might have. I don't remember who was supposed to give you the key. Like, we haven't played the starting area in... 
as long as we haven't played this Since game. we streamed the starting area. So how, here's how far we got last time. We got to, you see the timer counting down from 20, trying, counting up, sorry, from 2236. That's the military time for when it is. Well, we got to, uh, we got to midnight. And then things started getting hard, and I ran out of bullets, and I kind of rage quit. You're cute, cute. Yes. I, I think Kam and I will still be abusing bullets for this playthrough. Because... Doors are apparently a problem. Uh, because I, I, I don't know, I find, I find guns very amusing in this game. Right, I think the key's down here and I missed it. Buddy, 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 little doggy. Yeah, you can't get the doggy out. You doggy, tell me where the key is. Tell me where the key is. Where, Scarecrow? Where, Scarecrow? I don't see the key. Well, I'm fucking stumped. Well, I think we're, I think we're done. Yeah, well, that was Nosferatu Wrath of Malachi, everybody. I think you already lost the game, Adam. Where is the key? Maybe they randomly generated a castle without a key. What the fuck is this bullshit? Alright, new game. Up oh, there it is! Yay! He found yeah. the key to the East Wing. <laughs> After you died once. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that didn't happen. Yeah, no, that didn't happen. Oh, oh yeah. hey, father. James. Let's let's ignore you, father. The pain. I've heard you. I've heard you fall down those stairs like three times. I understand that it's very painful, father, but you I've got some vampires to assure you can. You should be dead by now, father. By now. I feel like this will also get old very fast. <laughs> well, going through the initial area multiple times, yes, yes, it will get old very quickly. Hello. Hi. I <laughs> to proposition you. <laughs> oh, come the fuck up, man. Goth is dead. No laying down on the job. Get out of my club. You dead. Still dead. No. Uh, no, he's, he's, he's busy having an existential crisis with the wall over here. Yeah, that's fine. Right. Ammunition for a revolver? I wonder if you'll get that as a weapon. Man, I can't wait until I get the revolver. That sounds like the oh. coolest weapon ever. Oh. I'll be just, just oh. clean Eastwood up in this snatch. You feel lucky, Igor? So is the, does the sword have any point then? Uh, it does more damage and you can wind it up, I, I distinctly remember. Well here, let's wind up a sword strike. Hi. God damn, the footlock fucking hurts. No. Fuck. Fuck! <laughs> oh yeah, I think they have found your weakness. It's bullets. It, it, the problem is the... <laughs> Fuck. Fuck! <laughs> Bye, father. Bye, father. So what I forgot was that they can hit you through the wall. What's the third Goonie? Apparently he's all tuckered out. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Why is he already dead? Were they gonna eat him? Why? I don't know, but thank god for this machine gun ammo. Mmm, machine gun ammo is so useful. I just imagine they, they take the flint lock and they put a little uh, magazine at the bottom. It just goes. <laughs> so the reason why this is, so is that. Hey, you have a steak now. Steak her. Steak her. Steak him. Uh, it. Steak it. Steak it. 
Let's take it. Let's take it. I can appreciate the vampire mythos this game has going for it. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. He, he kind of died. I'll accept that. Let's do it. All right, so the key, we've determined that the key is somewhere in this courtyard. Yes. Maybe upstairs. Maybe downstairs. Maybe there's a devil dog. Maybe there isn't a devil dog. Oh, there's a health kit over here and some holy water to spl splash around in. It's not holy water, it's just regular water. We now know how water works. Now it's amazing. Uh, you know, I've been... Um, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, as far as splashing around in this goes, I've been to a couple of churches, and they didn't, I've never seen any glowing blue water. I've been to a couple of power plants, and I've seen radioactive blue water. I'm just saying. Maybe, maybe I not... Adam, let the resident vampire mythos expert handle this. You just, you just, you just make sure you don't die. For the umpteenth time this day. I guess I should probably save my game, huh? Before the devil dog eats you. I ain't scared of devil dogs. Ah, uh, oh, fuck, it's not loaded! <laughs> yes, Adam, you have to reload. This game's interface is really bad, to be fair. <laughs> you have to reload your gun after you fire it, Adam. And the, on the right is whether or not your weapon is bullets loaded into your weapon. On the left is how much ammo you've got left just kicking around. Okay, wait a minute. Can I even get back here last time I played? I don't know. Why are you... No, oh, we, we remember this. We, we, we got to this, like, at the end. Yeah, well, yes, because there's a secret entrance out back or something that leads to... The what's the shit call it? I don't know. I still feel like we shouldn't have been able to find that. Just don't go in the graveyard, Adam, if you're down yeah, worried Yeah, I'm not it. going in there now because I don't have the weapons, but... What are the in the graveyard? I don't know. Stuff. What the fuck? Where did you come from? <laughs> Sorry, I'm late. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, please stop punching. Okay. I'm dead. Thank you for the bullets. Try the doghouse. Yeah, I punched it. Nothing happened, Common. What can I tell you? In the middle of the courtyard. Where that blood is. Oh no, look at all oh, spooky blood. Is that actually any explanation for what that, what all these blood stains are? Blood. Blood stains. No, no, seriously. I don't think any members of your family are dead. They all seem to be in pretty decent condition when you find them. Don't forget that your uh, Uncle Pork Chops is actually really good at pugilism. Oh yeah. No, that was cousin Jack face. Ah, ah fuck me. I like that you got more startled than I would, <laughs> even though I had the sound effect. Oh. Well, how is this key? Oh my god, not again. Oh my god. Not again. Can you look up a po like is there a list of possible locations for the key? But there's four on that side if you include the room that's under. And one over on there. The... How do you get there? Um... How do you get there? Let's experiment. This game. This game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice to punch you. Please just punch. To meet you. By the way, if you guys want to know why I seem to be so chicken shit about that uh, jump, it's because this game and jumping are not on good terms. Thank you. Come on. Thank you. Yeah, I got this. Is he staked? Yeah, I staked. Look 
more like hags than anything else. Yeah, Kevin and I had a very lengthy, very vitriolic debate as to what these things are exactly. And the answer seems to be werewolf, vampire, zombies. Oh, no, that's not the answer. What was it, ghouls? So, the thing you just killed, that those hag-looking things, Yeah. those are zombies. What? Yeah. There's like three different types of zombies in this game. Of course. No. Uh, no. Yay. Finally. Fucking finally. Uh, now, the things we've had the greatest discussion about are the thing that jumped out uh, at the door that you were punching earlier. I don't know if another one will jump. Yeah, those things. We've had a very, 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 very long discussion about what the fuck these things are. Qualities that they possess. They jump out of infinite portals that probably lead to the demon realm. Mm -hmm. uh, they hang around vampires. Uh, they bite and scratch and jump at you. So I said that they're werewolves. Adam claimed they were just stupid vampires. Like stupider than the normal version of vampires. What they actually are, are ghouls. Ghouls? Yes. The pointy-eared, wolf-like things that are between, halfway between a Nosferatu vampire and a werewolf are ghouls. Really? Yes. This fucking game. Uh, we're gonna be hearing that a lot. Okay. Okay. We have killed everything. We jumped over the castle. We didn't die. We have learned a very important lesson about ourselves and never giving up. So let's forget it immediately and proceed onwards. Yeah, I'm working on it. Hi, father. My father.